I just got back from my first ever Go Loud Planner Conference. And after watching all of last year's videos, I found out that apparently if you have a YouTube channel and you want to go loud, then you must film a haul video. So stay tuned to see all the goodies that I got at the conference. guys welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome my name is Tracy and I am a girl with plans so yes as I said I just got back from my first ever go wild planner conference I am still trying to get my voice back plan jamma was a blast um but yeah I definitely want to show you all of the goodies I got I am filming this the day after I got back because I want to start playing around with them I want to start using all the stickers and stuff in my memory keeper which means I need to share this stuff with you before I start using it so I'm going to try to go in order from like conference swag to like drops that we got throughout the conference to my table mate gifts and stuff like that. I'm going to go a little bit fast through some of like the overall conference swag just because everybody pretty much got the same stuff. So if you watch a lot of these videos then you're likely going to be seeing some of that over and over again. So I'm going to spend a lot more time on things like table mate gifts and stuff like that. But we are going to start with what I got as conference swag. And this bag that we got is huge. It is so big. It could have probably been my carry-on. And I'm dropping stuff because I'm knocking stuff over. And then here's the back of it. Super cute as a zipper. I have like put my little box in once I got home. I think it had a couple of things in it. You could pick up a whole bunch of these different like buttons depending upon which one kind of fit you whether this was your not your first rodeo if it was your birthday or your anniversary so I got my first go wild and then our shirt was in there super cute shirt too and I love gray t-shirts because I will be wearing this out and about <laughs> so super cute love it love it love it all right, so I guess I think there was a few more things. I think it was like a keychain or something, but you know, things get like thrown about and <laughs> I don't know what happened. So I actually got there Wednesday morning and I went to Shop Summit and with Shop Summit, I got some extra little goodies for attending that one. And I will say like Shop Summit, while it's kind of says it's geared toward business owners, it was very much about like, going after what you want and things like that. So I felt like it was pretty relevant, at least this year. I don't know about previous years, um, to pretty much anybody. It was very motivating and I really, really enjoyed it. All right. So Edding, which is a like stationary company, kind of sort of, I don't want to say like Zebra, but they have like a lot of markers and pens and things like that. They were the main sponsors. So I'm going to try to see what they had. I put other stuff in here. So this is an apron. I think it's a cloth apron too. Yeah, so it's like a cute little apron, little crafting apron. And then we got these uh, glitter brush pens. Now I think they're from Germany. And I think they said like a lot of this stuff isn't on sale yet in the States. They're coming over like this summer. But some glitter gel pens. And I haven't tried these out. Yes. As they all roll off my desk. This is why I don't film this as a YouTube live. Because <laughs> it's a hot mess. Let's see. I'm not going to do this for everything. I was just curious because of the glitter. These are really pretty though. Oh, that one was. I mean, I can, yeah, it's like faint glitter. Like, especially you can really see it more on the blue and this darker one. Actually, I can see it a little bit. I kind of like those. Those are kind of cool. All right, let me put that aside. So we got this little pen case. with getting my glitter on pen that if I knew it was in here, I would have put it on my little badge thing. And this is a fine liner. That's really cool looking. I thought it was just a regular ink pen, but no, it's a fine liner. Ooh, I like this color. 
And then here's a black one. So, and then a highlighter. We all know what that looks like. <laughs> Just a unique shape. Okay, so we have that, I think. Oh no, two more things from them that was in this bag. So this little clipboard that says nothing is impossible. And then these little mini permanent markers, they're 0.5. So that was what was in my shop summit bag. Again, I might be missing a couple of things that I've taken out. Because <laughs> you know that happens. All right. And then Laurel Denise spoke at shop summit. And then after she finished, we got this monthly project edition planner and these post-it notes. So this is just a little thin planner that you know you just have your calendar here and then some places to kind of write out what you want to do for like each week so this is a really cool like month at a glance type planner this would be really good for budgeting actually <laughs> this whole planner would be pretty good for budgeting you have a goal section and everything okay so this is super cool the problem is, is once I finish doing this, I'm like, where do I put it all after I finish going through it? And I'm also, not only do I want to play with this stuff, but I need to put it up. That's why I'm also filming this video early. And then Moxie Life gave us the Wild for Goals notebook. I believe that this was something that was given out to attendees at last year's conference. So it's actually a pretty thick cover. And it's just a dot grid notebook although the little dots are they look a little bit further apart than your normal ones so it's just a cute little dot grid notebook which i actually like taking these things now with me when i go places like it's like a travel journal and stuff like that just because they're a lot easier to carry around so i do appreciate getting these thinner kind of i guess soft bound type notebooks okay so that was it for shop summit um now let's see swag i guess we'll do conference swag and again i'm hoping to have everything together but i don't know um so there was a room drop this year i think this is the first time they did that whereas if you were staying staying at a hotel room that was part of the room block it got dropped off in your room however if not you could pick it up at their registration desk at certain times throughout the conference. So this is a Kell of a Plan self-care journal box. Love it. Now I know she had a self-care journal, but I think this one, just the cover and stuff is different because of the whole Go Wild theme. This was not part of it. I went to a happy hour <laughs> and this came with it. Um, so here's her little kind of explaining it and just welcoming us to the conference. Let me open this. So I'm really excited about this because I did not have her self-care journal previously. So it's a three month journal. And y'all do know I do have a self-care journal <laughs> that I have been using in bullet journal style. But this is more kind of like, I don't wanna say guide it, but it has some like little daily prompts here. So it's something that like I can use in combination with that. I think it's super super cute of course thick paper so then three months of that and then with that came these little stickers I have to admit I was really excited about and plus the sticker die cut sticker but I was really excited about the stickers so you have quote stickers about just overall self-care um, mental wellness and then you know of course her box stickers so she has the functional ones in here that fits her planner or this particular planner so look a monthly mood tracker so these are super cute and then of course yay we can date them so pretty much everything we would need to get started with this all came in this box yay heather with kell of a plan love it love it love it super super cute i was really excited about this actually <laughs> because it was one of those things when she came out with her self-care journal i was like should i get it should i get it and then i kept waiting um but yeah now i have it to try 
And then of course we got this when we first got there, this cute little bandana that is like, you know, it has like Texas on it and like the cowboy boots and some of the little um, uh, images that have been on some of the like swag and things like that but it's not like super like craft in your face it's a really cute um yeah it has pencils and scissors but it's just a really cute bandana all right let's see let's see let's see now this is going to be in no particular order <laughs> so i do know on the first day once we came back from our break there was swag and it was these two, well, it wasn't these two books because um, Amber plans her day, you could have gotten different books. Um, so there, there was a variety of books that you could have gotten from there, but everybody got this Go Wild sampler pack from Mojo Jojo, which has kind of like your memory keeping um, as well as your planning for 2025, as well as some of her boxes. So super cute. I have two of the regular books and I'm, I still, I'm super happy for this because I'm not just going to use this for go wild. I'm going to be using this for everything. I love the colors. And then of course I get spring essentials. Like I said, depending upon which bag you got, there were different sticker books in there from Amber Plants Her Day. I don't have this one. So I was really excited about that. I know it was like, a memory keeping sticker book, one of the colorful Bujo sticker books. I think I saw a Winter Essentials, um, the retro one. So there were just various ones, but I was super happy for this one. I was so glad I got this one. I would have been happy with any of them actually. Um, I really do love her books and they're super useful. Like I said, this one is a combination of decorative plus function which is always a plus so yay definitely some good swag here and then we got like notepads from christian designs this came in this was actually part of let me move that to the side because that came in another swag so during like archer and olives um when they they had a presentation we got this little fold out journal to write in. I did not write in it during the time because I wanted to save it for possibly something else. I'm not sure what, but I thought it was super neat and super cool. So we'll see. And then this is their May monthly kit. So, you know, if you have seen Archer and Olive does, they have their quarterly subscription box, but they also have these monthly kits. So inside it you I think you always get this bag and then you got some washi some stickers and some scrapbook paper so basically and then some regular paper to create with so you get enough stuff here to kind of create a fun little journaling spread or even a planner spread or anything like that so it was kind of neat to get this um to get this kit um especially because i think it's it's like 15 dollars a month if you want to do the subscription i am an affiliate for archer and olive so definitely check out my affiliate link down below if you're ever interested but yeah like I said, I'm trying to go through this kind of fast because you're going to be seeing some of this stuff on several channels. Um, so then we got this pen during a swag drop, but I'm not sure. Gold mine and cocoa. Okay. I didn't realize that was gold mine and cocoa. But with gold mine and cocoa, we also got these notebooks. They were different colors with different words on them. Let me open this. Okay. Ooh, so you have stickers in here. And then it's a lined journal notebook with, you hear that right? With really good thick paper. Yay. Um, so yeah, so those were from Goldmine and Coco. And then we have Archer and Olive. So these were drops during the main sessions. So like when certain like sessions were going on and like when Archer and Olive was given their presentation when the, over, the owner of the company was that's when this came out and then there was a founders panel on Saturday and that's when this came out with some other stuff that I have probably in my lap <laughs> we also got the life planner sampler pack from um Erin Condren it's basically a month <sighs> 
a month worth of a planner, but each week is a different format. So you can kind of, you know, try out some of the different layouts from Erin Condren's planner to see which one works for you. And I'm really excited about this. I almost wish every planner company would do this. I know Plum Paper um, has something similar, but I just feel like, you know, sometimes we try a layout and it, we think it's gonna work and it doesn't end up working. So I really, really like the idea of just using a planner for the month that has completely different layouts to see which one works for you. And I am going to use this. I'll just be using this as like a second catch-all just to see how I like it. So I probably won't be filming anything from it. Um, it this is just going to be for me to kind of figure out what I like. And then a whole bunch, bunch of shops also gave us some stickers um, that was part of the conference swag that came out. So you have Midlife Designs, Planning with Kay. I actually attended her session during Shop Summit. Very, very helpful. She is just a wealth of knowledge. And because of her, I'm at, because of her presentation, I might actually join her Patreon. <laughs> um, this one is Paper Shire. Yes. And then like sticker guru. I'm trying to make sure there's not anything on it. Salted pretzel stickers. Um, Charmin dreams. So yeah, just various companies. I think this, these stickers were part of another bag. <laughs> I just took everything out and put them all in one bag. Um, we also got this kit from Plum Paper like a sticker kit from Plum Paper. They did not have a table this year. I would have been like they were on my list for um, sponsored tables and it just so happened. So like I was going to be looking for a Plum Paper table. It was Plum Paper and Otique were like two of my top tables sponsor tables, which we'll get to that in a minute. And then I had the rep for the, um, she works for Plum Paper, happened to be in front of me in the line and she told me they didn't have a table. So it saved me so much <laughs> stress or just looking at the room um, to find out they didn't have a sponsor table this year. But yes, so we got stickers from them. And then we got Pip Sticks. This is a Hello Kitty one, I think. Did I already open this? Oh. Okay. So I think this might be part of a sticker kit. I'm not sure. I kind of missed if it was or not because I know that they do monthly subscriptions as well. They actually had a shop set up at the planner fair. So here, these are like little strips here with like <laughs> Hello Kitty on them. So yeah, this is their little Hello Kitty thing. Oh, these are super cute. I did a fun thing in my memory keeper, not my memory keeper, my currently last year with the um, squad girls that were on floats. So it kind of be fun to do that this year. So we just got a whole bunch of like Hello Kitty type stickers from Pip Sticks. And then a card. So this could be really fun. I have to figure out what I would use this for. I'm going to use it for something. Here comes the sign. This could actually be fun for my memory keeping journal or for my currently journal for like summer. It could be fun to do a Hello Kitty spread. So maybe that's what I'll do. We'll see. It's hard for me to think now because all I want to do now is do like go wild memory keeping <laughs> and finish my memory keeping for my last vacation. So I can't think that far ahead. Okay, I think, no, I guess I think that was it. But then at the very end, we got one last drop and this was just a bag. So you got different color bags. It just had some of the event sponsors with Go Wild, Erin Condren. And I think some of the stickers that I had earlier came from were in this bag. So this is a Southworth Premium Planner. So they do have, so it's year, yearly and monthly, monthly recaps, aspirations, and wellness goals. So like here's the check-ins where you can write your goals and things like that. And then you do your monthly overview. 
So this is kind of more like a goal setting kind of check-in type planner, which is what they said, right? So this goes through, I think the end of 2025? No, June 2025. So this is super cool. I hadn't heard of them before. I haven't heard of Southworth. So that was in our bag. Then we got another one of those glitter brush pens from Edding. I think that was in this bag. And there was something else in here that I feel like I've taken out. I think there was like another book of some kind in there, but whatever. Um, <laughs> so this is like more of like a card an advertisement card. So we got some stencils. Y'all know how I love my stencils. We got a sticker sheet from Verse Planning. Yay. I need to put this aside because that's going to be part of my memory keeper. Let me wait till I finish. And then we got the Paper House Sugary Gal Shop collab book. I actually have one of the books, collab books from this that I picked up from Hobby Lobby because they do have some of this at Hobby Lobby. I just think they're the cutest stickers ever. Super cute. Yeah, because I think that was in the book that I had for the Hobby Lobby. Super cute. So I think this plus something else came in that bag that was at the very last drop of the conference. It's just trying to pack stuff in your suitcase. I was trying to pack certain items and certain things so they wouldn't like bend up and then everything just got mixed up. <laughs> okay. Where to now? Sponsored table? Oh yeah, here is the book. I did, I had that somewhere else. I knew I had it. <laughs> this little book was also in that last bag. This is a Bloom Daily Planner, which is funny because I'm getting ready to go to my sponsor table next. And I, their table was very, very intriguing because there were so many like stationary products on there. I'm like, Tracy, you don't need any more stationary products. You have a lot. So this is just like a little pocket calendar, pocket planner. I will actually use this because it will fit in my tiny purses that I like to carry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there we go. Now that should be it for the overall conference drop swag and stuff like that. Now we're gonna get to the sponsor table. And I sat at a notique table. So like I said, on my mind was like plum paper and notique. Those were the two that were kind of on my mind, but I really didn't care where I sat. Um, then I found out plum paper didn't have it. So then I was like, oh, notique. I'm like, I am not gonna be able to sit at a notique table. I got down there in line probably around six and there was I don't know I'm a real bad judge of like counting how many people were already in line but I felt like there were like four to five hundred people still in front of me um so I'm like I'm not gonna get the table y'all I got the table because it was on the very far side of the room and people were not walking by the table so like they didn't everybody was going to the center and they were not really looking at the side of tables so like people that got in line at seven were able to sit at my table because of the fact that they just didn't know that this table existed. So Notique had several tables. There were tables with backpacks, tables with big purses. And I'm kind of glad I didn't see those because like the backpack one, I would have been like, ooh, I'm gonna sit there. I don't need one. I don't need another backpack. But you know, your eyes kind of like guide you and you just sit wherever. So I'm actually glad this was the one I came across first. So you got this um, bottle and it came in a box, which I don't have with me because I took it out of the box, but it has like the cleaning brush and then it has the top and the straw that you can put on it so you can actually drink it without unscrewing the top. We got a pen case and I have another one of these and I absolutely love these cases because they unzip pretty far down so you can actually see what's in it. I just love these. And then got the, the lunch bag, which I already put the crossbody. So it's a crossbody lunch bag. Y'all know I love my crossbodies. So this is where I put the other stuff in it. But you see it's like insulated as pockets galore. So it's a pocket here. Oh, there's something in here too. Oh, I didn't even know this was in here. Little tassels I can put on the zippers, I guess. That's how hot I didn't do it. I have pockets on the side. So we've got two pockets on the side, one in there. 
and then I have a pocket there. It's so cute. It's almost like a purse and not even, so I can have an insulated purse or insulated cooler bag. Um, so super cute. There, so it was black, red, and this color. I think those were the only three colors. So I sat for this one. I got this one. Oh my gosh. And then a desk planning pad for a weekly planning. So that was my table. And when I went into the room, I the reason why Nautique was one of the brands, so I already have a planner cover from them and I know their quality. But like I said, <laughs> I don't need very much stationery and we're getting so much stationery that I kind of wanted to sit at a table um, where I didn't get as much stationery and get kind of more, I don't want to say unique products, um, but these are unique as far as a planner conference. So I am ecstatic that I <laughs> first got to sit at an OT table and from what I got. So thank you. Thank you, VJ. Really, really appreciate your generosity. I appreciate everybody's generosity. Um, oh, a couple more things. So Heather Kell gave out these uh, luggage tags. So it says, go wild, Kell of a plan. And then she hand lettered your name on it. Then we had a couple of like crop sessions throughout the time. So there, there were a couple of these workshops sprinkled throughout the day. So like Simply Gilded had one. And you got, <laughs> this is a knife. So this is like a little exacto knife. And then washi tape. I have never had Simply Gilded washi tape, y'all. So I'm kind of giddy and excited about that. So I have all of this really cool washi tape. I love this washi tape. Someone at my table had three of them. So I traded for a second one. Because <laughs> I just, I really like this. You don't have this many. It's hard to get neutral colors sometimes for washi tape. So I was really happy for that. And then there were some papers so we could do washi art. But I was like, I don't want to use my washi. I want to save it. So yeah. <laughs> got some bookmarks. So yeah, that's what we got from the Simply Gilded Workshop which all their workshops and crops this year were all in the main room. Okay. Then we had Zebra's main workshop on, what was that, Thursday night? All the days are running together. So we got all of these for the workshop. So we got brush markers. I think like four of those and four of the regular mild liners. Then we got... A couple of pens, a pencil. This one's a pencil. And then here is the mark on pen. So it's not supposed to smudge once you like run it over with a mild liner. And then these are kind of the retro neutral is what I'm calling them. Um, 05 pens. Really like this one. The blue kind of writes close to the blue color anyway. A little, it's not as bright, but all the other ones are definitely kind of match the colors that they're in. So that's what we got from Zebra. I got like a ruler and stuff like that in there too, so we could like bullet journal with mark your pages. And then Bess from a Lights Planner Action, she did like um, a memory keep keeping little session, and all this stuff came in with it. This is an actual pocket. And like she was showing how you could put it like in here. I'm gonna put my room key in it, this room key. And I'm putting it in my memory keeping journal. That's why I didn't use it. And like these stickers fit. I was coloring um, instead of using it, like fit these boxes, but I think I wanna use it for my memory keeper. So that's why I didn't use any of the stickers. I'm like, no, I wanna use it for my memory keeper when I get back home. So we got this as part of that session. And then we got some bullet journal pages for when we were using some of the mild liners. All right, so that is the wild crop stuff. And then we got some stamps and some um, scrapbook paper and some stuff like that from Alt New during a session where we made a card to send to our future selves. They're gonna send it to us in six months. Um, so that was kind of fun to like craft a card, try, try out my card making skills. Okay, 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 almost y'all, almost, almost, I think. 
Um, before I get to table mate gifts, I have a few more things. So I got two sticker sets from Chrissy Ann Designs. She had a game going on, like a Plinko type game. And so I got these stickers from them. And I might've put other stickers in it. Like I think everybody got some of these stickers and I just put it in the pack so it wouldn't get ruined. And then, oh, I am forgetting something from Wild Crop. Yeah, we did get these from Wild Crop from Zebra. They're brand new dual to toned mild ink. So like this one, you have to get it to start, but then you can write in those two colors at one time. Really, really cool. Which one did I do? This one. So this one's kind of hard. Can't see the yellow as much. Is that the only one I did? No, this one's here too. You can see my lovely handwriting. There we go. You can see this one. So I think these come out this summer. Super cool. And I love the little case, <laughs> the mild liner case. So yeah, that came at Wild Crop. And then at my table for the Wild Crop night, um, Amy Tangerine sat next to me. And when she found out that it was our first time there, she gave us her book that she used last year when she did a wild crop session. And that was so sweet of her. And then she wrote my name on it. And then she like signed it and wrote, so, so fun going well with you. <laughs> so cool. So sweet of her to do this. But it was really cool just to sit next to her and watch her like fill in her memory keeping journal while, <laughs> while I was there because so talented. Okay, I think... For the most part, that's it for a lot of my conference-wide swag. So two more things. Table me gifts. Well, three more things. Contact cards, which what I'll do is I'll just spread them on the table and show you that. And then I went to an affiliate luncheon from Live Love Posh. So I will show you what came in that bag, but we're not going to go through all the sticker books that came in it because that will be later. Okay, let me grab my plum paper notebook, which I took with me. And I actually got my table mates to fill it out during the second day. And I can remember who gave me what. So I'm going to start. So Melissa did this one. Mel's Deck Daily, D-E-C. So Mel's Dash Deck, D-E-C Dash Daily. Maybe that's short for December daily. Um, so she does memory planning and she's fan of Erin Condren and Archer and Olive and all that fun stuff. So she gave us this cute little bag. The table mates were, it was just amazing to see everybody's creativity and just generosity. It was such a fun day. Um, so this is all the stuff. I think this is simply gilded, isn't it? I don't know. It has the bow on it, but then get this cute pen. Yes. Yeah, simply gilded pen. And then this can be like a little pen holder. Some llama socks. Now, I want to go slower for this because, like I said, people did spend a lot of time, money, and, like, some of this stuff is just so creative. Plus, I know, like, being a first-timer going to Go Wild, it is kind of like, what do you do for table mate gifts? And I think I have a wide variety of table mate gifts, so you can get, like, a great idea um, for it. Um... And like some people, <laughs> like this is a lot. Um, and you don't have to do a lot, but I just feel like, you know, I do want to like show it. Cause like I said, I'm very appreciative of all, everything I got. So I want to show it, but it's also to kind of give you ideas of what people do for table makers. So you have these little poppable llamas. All right, let me put all of the Simply Gilded stuff together. Okay, and then this cute little hand sanitizer, <laughs> Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer too with a little cowboy hat holder, super, super cute. This Mud Love kind of like positivity bracelet. This is Be Still. I guess this is like a little bookmark. This is Go Wild. See, people are just so creative. Like, I think I'm creative and then I see everybody else and I'm like, whoa. <laughs> 
So keep being amazing, llama amazing. So it's like a little compact. This is, is this the bookmark? Let's see. Page marker type thing. Yeah, I think you put this like on the corner of your page. Some help mark it. Super cute. Um, this petite journal from Erin Condren. And this is the productivity pages. And those of you who saw my setup videos <laughs> from December know that I have been using this. Um, so I've been using a lot of these journals. So I have one that I actually took with me to the conference. But I've been using these for like inventory lists and things like that. So I will, I'm very excited to have one of these. And then she also included several things from Simply Gilded. So we have some sticker sheets. I don't know if you guys can see it because, you know, Simply Gilded does all the foiling. Super cute. This is the Whale Tail sticker sheet set. So adorable. Some of their famous bow-themed washi tape and, like, the light pink with the gold bows. This is Simply Gilded. I have to see what this is. This feels thicker, so are they bookmarks? Yeah, these are like bookmarks. Okay, I just wasn't sure, so I wanted to make sure. So this is also the whale theme. So this might've came from like a box or something. Super cool, can never have enough of these. Bookmarks, straight edge, whatever you wanna use for it. And then this adorable, little like keychain from Simply Gilded as well. Yay. And then finally, I'm going to end up putting that back in there before I did. See, here's her contact card for Melissa. I wanted to put it in here, but like this is like for stickers or the contact cards that are big. So super, super functional. <laughs> I will definitely be using this right away. So this is also going to be staying out and I'm not going to put this back in the bag because I need to utilize this right away. But yeah, all this stuff came from Melissa. Thank you so much. I don't know if she's going to be watching my channel, but I'm so appreciative. Everything is super, super cute, super, super useful. And um, actually, I have never used Simply Gilded before this conference. So looks like, oh, that's right. I said I want to keep this out. So uh, yay, I'll be trying like new things. I know everybody else has used Simply Gilded. So I'm like last on that. <laughs> and that aspect, but after getting like all these cute things from Melissa, as well as from the crop, or the workshop, the washi workshop with Jerrica. I'm like, yeah, I am like all about Simply Gilded now, huh? Okay. <laughs> I don't know where to put everything. All right, so this one came from, I don't know if it's Nadia, N-Y-D-I-A. She is Nadia Nicole. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm so sorry, but it's Nadia Nicole and it's, NY and NY. So like N-Y-D-I-A-N-Y-C-O-L-E. She's also on IG. So she gave us this cute bag with all this kind of stuff in it. So I think this is a bag. A contact card holder, business card holder, whatever. So again, it's something else I'm gonna have to keep aside. So I'm not gonna put that back in the bag. This is one of those little pen holders. So it's like brown leather and you can just strap it over across your planner. Some pens. So this is every step is a growth, a no drama llama. Super cute stuff. Oh, y'all know I have a battery for my energy levels. This is my social battery. I should just wear this all the time so people know whether or not to talk to me. <laughs> and then this super adorable little um, paper clip, fancy paper clip, which I actually need to keep this because this will be really cute. A, in my planners, but B, for my flat lay photos, which I really need to up my game with. But I have a feeling with all this stuff I got... I should be able to have some cuter pictures. Okay, so I'm keeping this aside too, so I can use this like right after I finish putting all my contact cards out there. All right, and then Sandra, who is Creative Lady, but it's creative without the E at the end, so it's C-R-E-A-T-I-V Lady. She's from Germany, y'all, and she happened to be at my table both days. So funny. So, look at this cute little cup. And y'all, it comes with a metal straw. 
<laughs> so you can drink your shots with the straw. I mean, what? <laughs> super, super cute. Um, also gave us some cute little stationary items. So this one, this is like her little contact card. It has like the QR code, a little llama notepad, some little cute a little animal notepads. And then this is like the little wax seal stamps, which I know she does stuff like this. So she might even need that. And then, like I said, she's from Germany, y'all. Oh, and this is a um, pen. <laughs> a, pill, a pill pen. Um... And then, so she brought us a whole bunch of candy from Germany. And some other people did have snacks in their table magas. They've disappeared because I've eaten them. Um, I did not want to just chow down mindlessly on candy from Germany. So I wanted to make sure I brought it home. I actually took it out of this bag and put it inside of cups. So it wouldn't like break or get mushed. <laughs> so yay. So excited. This is going to be like one of my like treats for when I finish a certain goal, I think. So then also at my table, let me put this back in the bag, was Paula from Let's Plan Together. I'm sure a lot of you already know who she is, um, but it's Let's Plan and then the number two and then gather. She's from Colombia, Bogota. So she came all the way from Colombia. So I had someone from Germany and Colombia that traveled to get here. So this is, so she gave us some pens, some washi, a little, little hair clip, as well as some candy as well. And then she also owns her own sticker shop. So she had this envelope and I put her stickers in the envelope. And then she asked for, so all of her stickers were in this and she like hand lettered our name. Um, I don't know if you can see, but see, let's plan together. Definitely check out her sticker shop because you'll see. Look, she has some like Texas themed stickers. So I, I'm assuming most of these are available on her shop because she has bubbles, Colombian butterflies. Super cute and juicy summer. So yes, we got all of this from Paula. Let's plan together. Definitely check out some of these people's shops, y'all. They are just very, very talented. In addition to being super, super sweet. I've seen her like online forever. And then when she was sitting at my table, I was like, what? Okay, this next bag um, was from Jennifer, who actually lives in Virginia. But she doesn't have social media. But let's see. So she is a Coco Daisy fan. Can y'all tell? So this is like a pack. I'm guessing this is like a kit from Coco Daisy. This is, I think, one of those reusable like fold out bags that you can do like for fold out shopping bag. I think these washies are part of this because I got the Christmas kit. So I think all of these are part of this. And then this cute little llama keychain. So yeah, I think this was part of this. Y'all, look at this. Like when I say people were and like crazy generous, they were like, I was like shocked. Like my mouth like just like flew open. So like, I think this is all part of like a kit from Coco Daisy. Another shop that I see over and over and over again. I know I've even been to the website. Um, I mean, <laughs> look at all this. Um, but I've never actually purchased from it. So I've already looked at it and I just spent this up. Um, so now I get to try everything out. I mean, look at all these stickers. So what? One, two, three, four sticker packs. And then all of these. And then this. So these are stickers of the speakers. So how cute is that? trying to get organized <laughs> and then Trisha and I think she had a lot of snacks and they were they're gone now I ate them 
I, they were they were great for the airport um so she put these little plates in here because her thought process is like especially if you want a scrapbook we can kind of use these for scrapbooking super duper cute definitely on the theme i think i forgot what i think she said she got these from home goods like i said and some of these had like the little spiral papers in here. I had to take them out to pack, but um, like the presentation of these bags were super cute. I'll try to insert a picture of um what the table looked like, and I also have a photo of like the table um ever like a group photo. But what I did is I went around to everybody and I did a selfie with them and then I got them to fill out my book. So like this is front and back. So I'm going to probably photocopy one and then I'm going to put the picture of the gifts, the selfie, and then this next to each of my table mate when I do my little scrapbooking. So she gave us a whole bunch of stickers. I'm not going to take these out right now, but I'll probably use some of these actually in my scrapbook, probably on her table mate page. Then this cute little clip. Now, Trisha is, I met her on Wednesday night because my other table mate, I'll get to in a second. I met them Wednesday and they like literally, I was like their adopted roommate because they were roommates and I was kind of like, I didn't have a roommate. Um, so I ended up hanging out with them the whole conference and we had sat together um, on this day. So she made these by hand. So you have your little jumbo paper clip. Um with her little beading that's super duper cute and she has a code but i know she doesn't have like a planner page per se um but um maybe she'll start posting some more huh trisha but um it's trisha d-l-u-b-a-c that is her actual handle too so let me just make sure i'm getting it right on ig I'm pretty sure that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. <laughs> and But she didn't give me this one, but apparently Green Mountain Crafter, she put as her other contact information. Trisha, you didn't tell me about that one. What is going on, girl? <laughs> All right. And then her roommate was Nakoa. And Nakoa I met at the Kelva Plan Happy Hour on Wednesday. Um and literally hung out with her for the rest of the trip so she gave us this cute little cup and obviously as you can see she like did a theme with hers y'all look at this so a purple hair clip so she, if you she's so she had like purple and pink in her hair so it's so perfect that she gave us a little clip in purple hair clip in so a little notepad these are those like little books. I've seen them all over the place. I've never had one. So this is like for scrapbooking or you put them in your planner. Super cute. So purple. So she, the purple theme. And then the little like little key rings <laughs> and then grape lip balm. So yeah, she definitely went, she, she owned that theme, right? And definitely use the purple so that way we can remember her by. <laughs> all right, y'all. One more. I think just one more. And then I ended up meeting at the Live Love Posh Luncheon. Oh, wait a minute. I didn't say Nicoa. I didn't say her, um, her contact information. Hold up. Hold up. So Nicoa is Koa's Crafty Plans and that's K-O-A-S. So K-O-A-S Crafty Plans. So that's her handle. And then last but not least was amanda and y'all probably know her she's like plans with amanda and i didn't see her table mate gifts apparently she's from the video i've since seen that since i've gotten back home but um she made this herself so she ordered these bags and there's actually a pen pouch in here too and then she did all of these on the cricket and i have a cricket and I ain't done any of this yet so i need to up my game but <laughs> it was super super cute so she is definitely crafty. And then she gave us a whole bunch of goodies. And here is the other little matching pouch that came with it. And she also did this on there. Let me make sure I'm not forgetting anything. And some of her stuff might have fell out too. <laughs> because I had to use the cups. So like I said, I put stuff in the cups. Like I think this was the cup I put like the candy in. So it wouldn't mess up. So... She gave us, this is from the Happy Planner, Create a Life You Love. The straw is, I know where the straw is. It had plastic on, I had to take it off because like I said, I didn't want things to break. 
So she gave us one of the little block pads from Happy Planner. This one's sealed. I don't want to open it right now. So these are super cute um, for anything, like for your planners or journals or whatever. They're just, um, this is like a small sticker book. Oh, you can already see. Mamba sticks. I love the big letters. I love these. I have some and I think I've used a lot of the most common letters. So actually a replenishment <laughs> is a pretty good idea. So some llama themed um stamps we have some stick it notes and here's plans with amanda if you don't already know most of you probably are already following her if not you should she has a youtube channel as well as obviously instagram because most of the people you can find on instagram some of them do have youtube channels so then here's like a die cut and then i think she made this as well on her cricut just go wild dallas texas i'm gonna set that aside And then she threw in some washi. Let to go rolling off my desk. And then she, these little like room key, keychains, And I think she put the sticker on there herself. And then some like little stationary paper clips, binder clips. I think I'm gonna keep these out too. I'm gonna end up having to take everything apart and put the stuff up where they belong. All the washi has to go in my washi holders and everything like that. All right, so that is it for my table mate gifts. Thank you, thank you, thank you to all of my table mates. Everybody was so sweet. It was so funny that I sat at a table that had two girls from Virginia at my table. <laughs> Yay, Virginia. Um, so how ironic is that? All right, so I'm probably missing some stuff, but I'm going to quickly show you what I picked up from Live Love Posh because it was just a lot of stuff. I'm going to go through a lot of this stuff in a lot more detail, but um, so she gave us this cute embroidered bag. Um, so yeah, as I said, I'm an affiliate for Live Love Posh, so she had a luncheon for us. And then, I mean, I was just like, oh, a luncheon, that's great. <laughs> but in addition to the luncheon... She gave us a lot of stuff. Now, some of this stuff, if you sat at the Live Love Posh table, they got that as well. So that is another reason why I'm showing you guys, just because I do want to give you some ideas of what people were getting at the sponsor table. But some of this stuff I got because I'm an affiliate. So I know that these were at the table. Um, so yeah, I had used this to put stuff in it so it wouldn't get damaged. So this huge cup. <laughs> um... And I've already opened this because I use this box to transport stuff in. Um, but this I know was also at the Live Love Posh table. So it was packaged so cute. I could not recreate that after I got home. But she had given us like personalized little pen bags. Can never have enough of this. You could see how <laughs> this definitely wasn't how it was packaged. So we got all of these washi kids. Like I said, the people who sat at the table also got these. So this one, was it this one? Yeah, these are, these are all solid color washi. So it was the rainbow and then the pastel rainbow, which honestly, I don't have that much. I have very, very few solid color washi. And then these two are the ones that have patterns. So you, this one is solid with the stripe. And then this is the black and white ones. So these are the thin black and white ones. Here are the thick black and white ones. All right. And what you all really wanna see is brand new sticker books, which will be released soon. If you went to Go Wild, you actually had the option to purchase them at Go Wild. I will be doing full on flip throughs of these in a later video, but we have Chic Planner. I'll do like a tease. Look, quote y'all, look at the colors. Like, I love the elements that she uses in her book, but the colors. Ha, oh, this is just so pretty. And this is way different than her other chic planner one. So you can like, or it was crafty planner was the other one, wasn't it? Then we have office chic. Again, look at these colors. Like, I like, you rarely see a lot of the like black and white or darker colors 
Love it. All right, like I said, I'll do a full on flip through later on. Let's show this one first, Chic Crafter. Look at this with the beads and stuff. And look, I have like a whole armful of them that I got from generous people again at the, at the conference. And then finally, Wildly Chic. Y'all, I did, this is the first time I've looked at these. <laughs> Which is why I said I was going to do a flash, like a quick flip through. And I'm going a little bit slower because I'm looking at it. Oh my gosh. All of these are so gorgeous. Like I said, I'll do a slower flip through and a plan with me probably in the coming week. So definitely stay tuned. But these are the new sticker books. Now, again, I think most of this is what was available on the table. If you sat at the Live Love Posh table, minus obviously um, the name on the bag. So it was all of that. I don't know if the candle was on the table or not, but we got this cute little howdy candle with the boot. It smells super good. It's this wild sage, wild sage candle. And to like get this home, I like wrapped it up in clothes and I put washi <laughs> over the boot, even though it looks like it's screwed on. So if it fell off, I could have just re-screwed it on, but I did that. Um, we have a pen holder. Now, this isn't part of my bag, but Live Love Posh, um, they had a card that came in the box, like in your um, registration box. And as part of the swag, you can get this cute little notepad. And then some die cut stickers. I need to put that up here so I remember to use them in my memory keeper. And then... She gave us all this long sleeve cute shirt that I know you guys cannot see because it's so big. I can't show it all, but it says Planner Babe Essentials, Posh Planner, Live Love Posh Stickers, Wash and Lux Washi Cutter, and all the pens Live Love Posh. I cannot wait to use it. It's actually, I'll probably be able to wear it to this week because y'all, the weather is not very spring-like. <laughs> all right. So thank you, thank you, thank you, Jessica, Danielle, and the entire Live Love Posh team being so overly generous. I mean, the luncheon alone was more than enough, but then all this other stuff. All right, so contact cards. Also got some sticker sheets from like, they were using that. I'm gonna throw all these out on the table and I'm gonna like spread them out and then I'll come back and we'll wrap this up. All right, I don't even think this is all of the cards, but these are all the contact cards. I just wanted to kind of like lay them out on the table just so that way you can see all of the different variations of contact cards. You can see some people put like pens and there were a lot of snacks. Some of the snacks have gone missing. That's why some people had bags and then there was just <laughs> like Janda. She had hers in a bag. I just took it out because I ate all her snacks. So um, <laughs> that's why I took it out, which me and her, we had met the night of the welcome party and chatted for like a couple of hours. And then she was saying she was going to get downstairs for the first official full day of session at seven o'clock while I roll in at eight, um, six. And we literally walked to the line, up to the line at the same time. It was hilarious. So funny. But as you can see, super cute stuff. Like Miss Lizzie did this little pen that she came and gave me. It's this Texas size plans. Super cute. So many people are so creative. Like here's like a little charm from Planner Girl 07. I can't go through everybody because there's just so much stuff here. But you can just see how everybody was all creative <laughs> with their contact cards. All these like extra little bracelets. Like I said, I got so many. Like a couple of these. Like one of these. Which one? I think this one was from Mojo Jojo. This came in our swag drop. Which one was the one? I think this was the one that came in our Go Wild box. So I think these two were from like swag drops. I think everything else is what I had picked up from people throughout the week. So look at it. Like, yeah. <laughs> Everybody was just super generous. I had a great time. I do plan on doing another Go Wild video. What I'm going to probably do because I really want to get into my memory planning and I'm going to like try to print off some pictures. I think I'm going to just go through Walmart instead of like burning up all of my paper from my Canon Ivy. Um, 
I think what I'm going to do is start working in my memory planner and then I'll do a video where I'm flipping through it and then maybe we'll do like, uh, um, I'll be doing like a plan with me and I can answer any of your questions about the conference. So if you have any questions, you can just leave them down in the comments and I'll try to answer them during that video. Maybe if I get feisty, I might even do a live. I don't know. I don't know if I'm there yet because this video was pretty long and it wasn't a live, but I'm gonna try to edit it to get it down a little bit. So we'll see. <laughs> but I do plan on doing another Go Wild video. Like I said, just to show you my memory keeping book, which if you're interested in Go Wild, that could be interesting, but it's just memory keeping in general. So even if you're not interested in Go Wild, it's still maybe something to check out. So there we go, guys. I don't even know if this is everything. I'm almost positive these aren't all the contact cards I got. This is just a few. Um, but look how cute. I mean, everybody had such cute contact cards. Everybody was just super generous. And like all of these are stickers. Those of you who have been around, you know that you probably already know that. But I think I'm not going to take them off. I think I'm going to like put them in my memory keeping book. So now like I have an Archer and Olive eight by eight journal that I'm using for memory keeping. And I was going to use it for like multiple years in case I decide to go back to another planner conference. And now I'm like, y'all, do I even, am I going to have enough room after I put all this stuff in there? Cause I want to save all of the contact cards. Like I want to put them all in there. Um, so yeah, I think that's what I'm going to end up doing. So we'll see. So definitely be on the lookout for that if you're kind of curious how I'm going to put my memory keeper together. Like I said, that's going to be mostly a flip through, but I'll try to do a plan with me of a quick fun spread. Um, so yeah, that'll be in the future. But there we go. <laughs> that is my Go Wild 2024 swag haul, table mate gift haul, my haul from my Live Love Posh luncheon. Again, had such a great time. It wasn't all about the swag. It really wasn't. Um, I am grateful for all of the swag that I did receive. I will use it all. Um, Cause, and if there's some reason that I won't, I definitely like my cousin's little girl is super into art. So everything that I won't use will be used. Um, but I just felt like I got a lot of practical items and so many things that I'm super excited for. So now there we go. I think I've said there you go like five times and I keep talking. Um, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that thumbs up button. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would really appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel. Um, we'll see what kind of fun stuff I plan on doing. I'm getting kind of into the whole like bullet journaling with stickers thing. So I do that, but I still do my regular plan with me's on occasion. So um, definitely think about subscribing to my channel. So that way those can like pop up on your news feeds or you can even hit the notification bell when I actually post new content. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And that is all I have for now for real this time. And I hope you have a good rest of your day, evening or night. Until next time. Bye.